And welcome back to Cathedral Ward. Just in time for the sunrise or sunset, I don't know which. One of them. Um, we have a lot to do. We had a bunch of requests and things like that, you know? Yeah. Um, in editing, and somebody in... Th and I did ask in the essay thread, too, like, did I miss something? I, we didn't see out of progress, yeah. but... Uh, there wasn't... I, I confirmed it in editing. There was a stairway back where Alfred was. Do you remember mm. Alfred, that guy? I do, yeah. Yeah. There was a stairway back where he was. And also, an NPC we didn't talk to at the very beginning of this whole place. How dare you miss that thing you're so bad at video games. I know I am. It's video game. It's video games 101, really. Um, and look at this. Fire. Now, I didn't understand fire paper, by the way, right. when uh, Alfred gave it to us. It's Yarnham's version of the pink slip. Apparently, it's Yarnham's version of... What is that? Oh, uh, resin, I guess? It doesn't... This looks like something to scare away enemies, based on the description. Didn't it say you could rub it on stuff, though? Wasn't that a thing? I just like, looked at the last sentence. Oh, coarse paper that applies fire to weapons when rubbed. Okay. Yeah. So it can do a combination of the two. I believe it can. Like in Dark Souls 2, the torch would scare some in, well, like, maybe one enemy away. Mm-hmm. Okay, so this is weird. I don't, I thought I made a whole lot more progress in Cathedral Ward, yet here we are, right at the beginning already. Well. <laughs> uh, okay. Well, here's the NPC I missed, and... Oh. Ooh, don't hello. know how he missed that. She looks very cartoony here. <laughs> I'm melting, help me. Oh, you must be... Very sorry. The incense must have masked your scent. Good. Uh, yours too. That's how I missed you for so long. Do not extend the saw blade, whatever you do. Waiting for it to end. It always does. Always has, you know. Since forever. But it won't end nicely. Not this time. Even the summer folks hmm. hiding inside are going bad. Screams of women folk. I see. The stench of blood. They're not milk. The snarls of beasts. <laughs> None of them's too uncommon now. Yarn and fun to tell you. But if you spot anyone with their wits about them, here goes the neighborhood. This here Odin chapel. <laughs> They'll be safe here. The incense wards off the beasts. Spread the word. Oh. Come on over. Hmm. If you wouldn't mind. <laughs> Remember, uh, that old woman? Remember, uh, she was like, you know, is there anywhere safe to go or whatever? Oh, yeah. Good should, call. We should, go, we should go back and tell her at some point. If you and can we find her again. Uh, I know where, I know exactly where she is, actually. It's back oh. in Yarnum. We have one other order of, we have a few orders of business, actually. Okay. We did get uh, a couple new things. We had a top hat. I heard you made a to-do list. I did, actually. This is our top hat. No. Yeah, I didn't think no. so. Either, honestly. No. <laughs> so let's go back to uh, Hunter Hat. No, Yarnum Hunter Cap. Um, I could go see. for the top hat if you wore nothing else, but and covered yourself with the oil in the oil urn. But otherwise, no. Uh, I think it looks like we just got copies of everything else. I think that the top hat was the only new thing. Does everything the top else. hat have any special properties? It looked, it actually looked a little worse, I thought. Um, it's, oh no, it does have better, it's better versus blunt attacks for some it reason. I, I don't look at me, man. <laughs> uh, it's worse against magic, which is exactly the opposite of what I would have thought. Yeah, the top hats perform magic. Yeah. Um, oh, let's look at the item description. Want to watch you pull a boar out of my hat? <laughs> Uh, let's see. Formality. Oh, it's seen by the use of the threaded cane. I would love it if in the South, when hunting season started, everyone wore top hats. I like how they're talking about formality and how it goes with the cane. It is, that is the rattiest top hat I've ever seen. It's awful. It's a hand-me-down. Come on. Well, well, you're gonna go for a little bit of genteel, a little bit of class, you know? I'm saying, like, really, let's go the whole whole nine yards here. Well, you, tr you tried using the cane for walking instead of just killing people. I haven't, admittedly. Thank you. I have not. I apologize for that. 
don't think I need shining coins. So you can mark off a try on the top hat off your to-do list. This is true. But I, uh, and I also can now use... There's one more thing on the to-do list. Check it out. Oh. Um... Whoops. That is not the zoom in button. So you can fire shots at specific things to pull them. Yes. Uh, and this, I guess, more or less turns it into a first person uh, shooter. Yeah, play the whole rest of the game like this. Oh, I plan to. Good. No, I can't run in it, though. Oh, no, wait, I can. I'm sorry. So does the monocle come with its own crosshairs? I can jump with it. I got Monocular, it. Monocular, excuse me. Yeah, no, that's how min uh, monoculars work, mm. as I understand it. Um, yeah, I'll have to do some item reshuffling in a bit. Uh, so what do you want to do? You want to progress in Cathedral Ward? You want to go back to Yarnum and do stuff, or what? I'm feeling progression. I agree with you. I want to see new shit. Me too. Uh, let's see here. If you so, tell the lady that it's safe here, she'll probably come up with some excuse to stay in her house. Yep. So here we go. Now that we've reached Alfred, let's. Uh, Can you believe no one's writing your messages? Uh, this is, I, I don't know. Oh, Madman's knowledge. So um, I did. So learn... don't use that, or you'll get spoilers on the finale. <laughs> <laughs> hey. Uh, I did that learn a little bit. That will be timely in a few weeks. I did. <laughs> I did learn a little bit about uh, Madman's knowledge and insight and stuff, though. Okay. Can survive this drop, right? I did hear that when you get too much insight, something bad can happen. I've heard something to that effect, but the bigger thing is that, uh, or the, the, I should say, the thing I know about is um, if you summon people or do, like, you know, co op stuff, it uses one insight to do so. So okay. you spend it, you spend insight that way. But you're right, there is some sort of effect, but apparently you get new monsters and stuff, but. The game does get harder, so it's kind of a trade-off between I want to show off cool shit, so I want to collect more insight, and I'm not very good at this. So. We got another... We had a, we have a couple of these items, too. The Tempering Bloodstone. What was the difference with those and the Blood Gems? Um, This is weird. There's like... Oh, look, Blood oh, Gem effects. So oh, I think you own. use them... Fortifies weapons, yeah. Oh, so they're like... It's like Materia. Yeah. Maybe. But While can you exchange here, them? Uh, oh, uh, I'm not sure. Or is sure. it use it once and then it's set? I think another good item while we're here to read about is the foreign trousers that we came in with. Oh, yes. You know. But if you notice the last sentence, without memory, who will ever know? Ooh. That's what they say at American Apparel, too. All right, let's move on. Enough of this nonsense. Oh, dear. Oh, dear, dear, dear. Mm. That's... Oh, hello. Yeah, Why are its eyes kind of glowy? Or is that just seeing the dark eyes? I think that's seeing the dark eyes. Alright, I shouldn't fear this asshole But it's not anymore. fit through small doorways eyes. Damn it, again. So, again, no, 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 that's, again, though, it's like, it's up to, you know, down to switch, whatever, forget it. Patch it from... It's time to extend that saw blade a bit. Oh well, maybe not. Actually, he's not too bad. I know werewolves are your kryptonite in this game. Yeah, but I feel like I'm uh, starting to get, you know, pretty good at them. Or I'm overleveled. That is. No, uh, You've got the werewolf all to handle them. I feel like this is dark as shit, by the way. It is. It's because you're in the depths. I wonder if this is a time from for the torch. You know? Oh. Oh, you know. You know what? Good call. Also, yeah. You can, as you can see, by the way, attack people with the torch. So. Yeah. In a, is this bothering you kind of way? Mm hmm. Well, you notice I also have an oil urn equipped. That's right. That's damn right it is. Uh, yeah. So. Well, you can roll around, destroy stuff, which you're doing now. Mm hmm. Might right. be some hidden items. Oh, yeah, maybe I should destroy more pots. Whenever you play a From Soft game, you gotta roll over everything. You're right. It's the law. Well, you know, 
I just... I feel bad hearing. I mean, I feel like the stuff in Cathedral Ward is going to be priceless someday. <clears throat> Jack Slate is like a kid in a pottery store who's a dick. Okay, that's true, yeah. Oh, dear. You have the right to remain priceless! <laughs> uh... Weird. Ooh, wow. These look almost like trap. What the hell Just is this Just waiting about? for something really bad to happen. Oh, yeah. I'm, I would not mess with those. They're, you know, they're, I, I guess they're meant for, uh... You. Yeah. That's fucked up. Then some prank werewolf pushes me. What the Although hell? they're not placed very smartly. Are these like Victorian era spike strips? Are those remnants of things you destroyed? Is that a lantern I see before me? Oh. Yeah, all right. Yeah, lanterns denote safety, normally. Yeah. Unless they're mimic lanterns. We do have 8,400 to spend, but... How big of dicks would Frum be if they had mimic lanterns? This is interesting. Look at that. Hmm. Well, <laughs> I mean, it's begging me to. Put on the top hat. It's a non-hunter disguise. It's for formal hunters, but you're wearing this other shit, so they, they won't think otherwise of it. Old Yarnum, you say? Oh, old uh, Yarnum. Stick to Cathedral Ward or go down here? I'm thinking stick with Cathedral Ward. Fair enough. I mean, we'll hunters just... are not wanted there. Well, yeah, but, you know, I mean... I'm sure the werewolves feel the and same way. And if there's way. anything I've learned from video games, it's that you always want to follow the rules. Very true. Right. Is that a treasure chest? Uh, where? Maybe. It oh, wasn't. No, I think it's just a. Oh, just planks. Breakable box. Yeah. Oh. It uh, looks tra treasury though. Does look treasury. My nuts are. Is that kind of it for Cathedral Ward? Or there's got to be more. Right. Well, maybe it's more of a transitional area. Well, the object was to get to the Great Cathedral in it. Well, maybe the uh, Great Cathedral's in Old Yarnum. Oh, uh-oh. Didn't you see the warning? Turn back at once. Old Yarnum, burned and abandoned by men, is now home. Who's saying that? And how did they get a megaphone? I knew that Bloodborne was a most dangerous game, but... Well, okay. I'm convinced. Uh... <laughs> Hunter, are you indecisive? Hunter. Why are you doing that, Hunter? That reaction did not match at all. That was not... Oh. That did not warrant joy. Looks like I missed that thing crawling away from me. That was me. Sorry. <laughs> I mean, old Yarnum seems, uh... Old. Nice. Well, they're not gonna call it nice Yarnum. What was this thing that burned? Ew. A person. person with rat ratty-ass teeth, I gotta say it. Well, that's why they burned them. Oh. <laughs> that, that was dentistry. Sick of then. having you not go to the dentist! <laughs> uh, it's free on your insurance. Oh, hello. Two cleanings. Very, what are you? Huh. It was a human wolf hybrid thing. Oh man. Are wolves and humans fucking in an old Yarnum? <laughs> I feel like, just so you know, the game's hitching a little bit at that bridge. Who now? Maybe it's loading some enemies? Hmm. Oh, they're about as fast as I am. <laughs> oh, they want to give you a hug so bad. They look a little... Oh, hey, better. get over here! Yeah, there's... This is kind of the blight town of, uh... Um... Bloodborne, I think. Why do you say but. blight town? 
it, it there is a come there's a frame rate thing I just hit. Oh. oh. Yeah. Also, it's fun. No. Um, yeah. Hey. There's a yeah, giant what, poisonous this... swamp at the bottom. <laughs> um, should I explore here more? Or? Sure. What All strikes right. your fancy? A little worried about. Oh, what the fuck? A little worried about this thing. Uh, what that fortune teller? Well, that thing with the bag on it. The towel. The the thing that was showering apparently and drying its hair. Oh. Oh, that's why the guy talking to you was echoing. He was in the shower at the time. Oh. He was bouncing off the acoustics in the bathroom he was using. Yeah. Yeah. This is uh quite odd. I was about to say quite old. There's something not... a little off about old Yarnham here. <laughs> hmm. Not like that friendly like central Yarnham. <laughs> uh I mean they, at least at Central Yarnham, they had like kind of a sense of community spirit. Yeah, Central Yarnham is like the French Quarter if you're in New Orleans. Right. Ooh, hello. But once you leave those touristy spots, mm -hmm. it's like a mummy wolf hybrid kind of deal. Mummies yeah, and wolves of, fucking? A lot of monster fucking in here. Right. Maybe that's why Hunter's not wanted. Maybe Jack Slate would have been into it. You guys don't know. Unless you have a mummy or wolf bride with you. <laughs> we call this monster mash. <laughs> Oh, Yarnum, it's our oh. euphemism. And in here we write monster slash uh -oh. fic. Thank you. I mean, is that it? He's just complimenting me over the loudspeaker now. I mean, you're kind of klutzy at times too, and reckless. Wow, did you see Shower Beast go nuts there? <laughs> It's like, ah! Lift shower! So you can see now I figured out the repost pretty much. Yes. You yeah, give you them just... time to fall on their booties. Yeah, and then you pretty much hold forward before you do it just to make absolutely oh. sure you're as close to them as you can get. Yeah. It's it's not, you don't have to hold forward. It's about proximity, though, you know? I gotcha. Um, okay, so so far the monsters in Old Yarnum are. Uh oh. Seems pretty manageable, so. Ooh. What? Ooh, oh my god. <laughs> uh. <laughs> well, I wasn't expecting that in old Yarnum. Call of Yarnum. What the fuck? Um. So, Gatling gun, I guess? That's a Gatling gun, yeah. Alright, I'm gonna just admit right now I'm not really sure at all how to handle that. And if you keep gunning, I also have a nuclear warhead. A Gatling nuclear warhead. Yes. I don't know. Well, I don't think you can just blink at him with your gun from there. You just no. have to make a run for it to get out of his uh, vision. I mean, unless there's like some kind of, I don't believe I'm saying this, like a sniper's rifle type of weapon and that's... I doubt that. This is a very odd part of a Souls game. <laughs> Whoa! Oh, no, it's just it. Oh, wait, he's bigger, right? Yeah. It's taking a rather uncharted-y turn here. <laughs> oh, did you see his face real quick? Uh, yes, I did. Well, damn. I'm learning a little more about the residents of, uh... Looks like they didn't do a very good showering job. No, they did not. Forget to scrub the face much? <laughs> So this kind of sucks that I have 10 grand in uh, Echoes and there's a Gatling guy on my ass. Well, that lantern's not too far back, right? No, but I, I do have to, but the, the machine gun dude wasn't there before. Well, I mean, if you want to go back to the lantern real quick and uh, you can warp there, can't you? Oh yeah, don't I have, um, is it Bold Hunter's Mark, I think? Homeward Boner or something of that effect? Something like that, right. Just don't, if you, there's an item that's equivalent to the dark sign, do not use that. There is, but it's, um, you're talking about the thing that's like, I give up, just take my, oh gosh, soul. Echoes! 
No, no, no. I was talking about the Dark Souls. Thunder. Gatling guns. Uh. Jeez. Hmm. I should not be behind this wooden thing, probably. No, it's perfectly safe. What you need to do is find the place where the quick time event happens for you to roll past the bullets. Oh, shit. Wow. <laughs> oh, good. I, I'm glad I did that for fucking poison antidote. That's very... are, are you even still in there? No. Oh, sorry. Ah! All right, let's keep going, I guess. Oh, so he says the hunter becomes the hunted, but I feel like he's kind of. Oh, damn it! I was expecting not that. You are a masterful right. hunter, truly. <laughs> All right. I think you can I be think... a little more courageous in the face of futuristic technology. Yeah, Jack Slate wouldn't worry about the guy. Exactly. Gun. He would That's charge. Fair. He would jump onto the bullets and j jump along them. That's fair. <coughs> like they were slow-moving missiles or bullet bills. I know. I'll employ the wooden shield. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> but while we're here, let's read an item. All right. Just remember you got 10K echoes to collect. The sword, the sword hunter badge. There you go. There's, there's some mm. stuff about Ludwig. Healing church hunters. This, this just doesn't make sense. Oh, look at that. As it was, clerics transformed to the most hideous beasts. So, uh, I got this from Cleric Beast, actually. Well, there so, you go. I wonder if he was once Ludwig. Probably not. No, that's probably just a huge coincidence. No, probably not. All right. That's what happens when your finger slips. Uh, anyway, so. All right. Wait, how are you not dead? <laughs> Hold on a minute. Wait. What kind of bullets? How come our townspeople didn't benefit from this? <laughs> We'd have a real overpopulation problem if that were the case. Oh shit. Well, don't just run past everything. <laughs> uh, hold on, hold on, hold on. Let's uh. <laughs> Let me just immolate myself real quick and. <laughs> just crowd control that. Thank you. There you go. Mostly. <laughs> yeah, all right. You know, it kind of yeah. works. Take some stuff here. What do you? What do you? What do you? What, what odds do you give me on getting back my uh, souls? Well, I think the you echoes. can get back there. Echoes. I think you can get back there pretty easily. Should I kill stuff or should I just? Yeah, I guess. I should, you just right? played too scared with the face of the uh, Gatling gun. Gatling gun. Yeah, you're right. Before the Gatling <laughs> gun, you were just mowing down motherfuckers like it was nothing. So let me tell you from a gameplay experience. Yeah. When you're when you're playing something like a, a, a Dark Souls like you know or whatever. Yeah. And then like yeah you're getting rained on with like the whole gunfire and stuff. You have this like <laughs> quizzical look on your face the whole time. <laughs> it's like kind of exciting, but you're like, what the hell? Am like, I playing the right game? <laughs> and then you go up to the guy. It turns out he's Master Chief. <laughs> That's the big surprise at the end. This is Halo 5, the <laughs> yeah. Zion. I'm the truth. Oh, am I poisoned? You get closer and closer, it starts going, Oh. I think I'm poisoned. No, you're not poisoned. That's the procurement rate of being poisoned. Oh, if that fills up, I get poisoned? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, okay. That's how it worked in the previous games, from my experience. I, it's been a few months since I played a... A, oh. a video game. Yeah. No, I, Gatling guy didn't do anything for a little bit, so I was like, oh, maybe he forgot about me this well, life. Well, he thought you were dead. He saw you fall to your death. It's true. Well, if it isn't big shower skeleton monster. Oh, he's poisonous. <laughs> I guess that's the poison symbol. I mean, they do, and they do give out antidotes, which I think is like a pretty ah, big... Yes. You know. True that. Oh, shit. I can't. Harry! <gasps> Slowbeef, no. Uh, 10,000 echoes. 